Hello, and welcome to Paper Play with Julie Kay. Welcome everyone, and thank you so much for stopping by to check out my latest video. And I'm excited to share with you guys a swap that I received from Rose, who is Rosebud Morgan on Instagram. She's a wonderful, talented artist. And we were paired together in a Facebook group, Decoupage and More. So I was excited, because I've never um, had a swap before with Rose, so I was kind of excited to, to be paired with her. And we were, for the swap, we were to make some altered cups, which I believe are in these, um, just feeling them. I've had the swap in my hands now for a little bit, um, but I decided that I wasn't going to open it up until I sent her the, the altered cups that I was sending her. She had to send me her swap a little bit early, um, due to some family obligations. So I've had it for a little bit and I've been excited to open it up. Every time I walk in my craft room, I could see the box thinking, oh, I wanna open up. But now today is the day, so I'm really excited. And I think I'm gonna start with the altered cups first. So I'm gonna open those up real quick and then we can talk about them. Ooh, I already like what I see. Um, very cute already. So like I said, she's very talented. So it's, I'm, like I said, I'm kind of excited to see what she created here. And then she included th some goodies in these other packages that were supposed to be put inside of the, inside of the cups. And so um, our cups, I think we were supposed to have at least a little bit of pink on them because it is, October, which is Breast Cancer Awareness Month, and they also were to have some sort of mechanism to hang them on. And so let's start with this one. It's very pretty. Um, she kind of did a shabby chic style with, with, with a little bit of touch of vintage, it looks like. So many fun ones. My goodness, she went above and beyond decorating. So cute. I love it such pretty paper that she has wrapped around the cups and some beautiful trims. I love that little rosette trim. And look at the beautiful bling that she has on this one. That's stunning. And all the pretty flowers. I love it, Rose. You did a, a wonderful job. And that's a pretty piece of bling too. Very pretty. And here's a gorgeous blue one. Oh my, look at this one. And I guess on this one, she did have kind of a filling in it right here of some pretty little lace. I didn't show you guys that. Sorry about that before I moved on. I'm just so excited to look at the other ones that um, I just love getting handmade things in the mail. So very, very fun. And then the pretty hanging mechanism. It's kind of cute that she did. She did two different laces. I don't think on the ones that I sent her, I was quite that fancy on my hanging ones. I just did some seam binding. And so hers are really pretty with the two types of lace. You know, this lace and then this lace. And then she put some more of this really pretty vintage style lace on top of that. So here was that blue one that we were looking at. I think on this one she glued these in so um, it doesn't come out on this one. So these ones were glued in. I love the inside of this one. This is really pretty material or lace, or tool, whatever you want to call it. Um, very pretty. I haven't seen anything like that one before. And then the, like, tool on the outside. But this one's very pretty. It almost looks like Marie Antoinette or somebody. Gorgeous. Look at that pretty, pretty trim on the top. She has some wonderful trims, that's for sure. And again, 
she outdid herself with all the beautiful bling and flowers. So pretty. A nice little flower cluster also at the bottom. Gorgeous. I love these. Hopefully she likes mine. Mine are, mine are different than hers, I guess. Um, I just can't stop looking at all the details, so I'm sorry. I'm being kind of quiet there. I just love to look at all the little details on things. So pretty. I love these. And then here is the last one. And this one had another gorgeous handle on it. It's a little pink bow on the top. And then also, here's some more of that little netting trim, but in pink this time instead of the blue. Isn't that pretty? She has some fun trims and dangles and pieces of bling. I mean, look at that one. Isn't that gorgeous? And that flower. Those are really pretty flowers. Another beautiful piece of bling. Some more fun trim up the top and the bottom. Wow. I love it. I don't know. You guys will have to let me know which one your favorite is. It's kind of tough for me to decide. I like all of them for different reasons. So pretty. These are going to be fun to hang up in my craft room. And then she had this little bag in the box uh, with kind of a clear see-through bag. And it looks like she has kind of some fun, I'm not going to open it up all the way, but some fun little vintage spools, thread spools in there, which these are perfect for um, like wrapping around small laces in your stash or ribbons, or you can also use them to make like altered tassels. So I love these. And I... In my craft room, I actually have a few of these kind of scattered around too, just because I decorate in a vintage flea market style. So those are like really fun. Thank you, Rose. Wow. She really outdid herself with lots of goodies. Very pretty. Look at the lace on that one. Or the trim. That's gorgeous. Okay, Rose, you can be my swap partner anytime you want to be. Wow. Oh, she gave me some of those pretty flowers that she had on the one cup or similar. Aren't those pretty? A fun little piece of lace. This is gorgeous. Ooh, a nice little applique. Very pretty. That's beautiful too. Some pretty lace. I want to say that I sent her almost a similar lace except for mine wasn't gathered at the top. So that's kind of funny. Oh, these are pretty. She's packaged everything so, so nicely. Lots of little flowers that she looks like she made these. Maybe a store-bought one, too. I don't know. These ones look handmade, though. I'll have to look at those closer. Some napkins. Those will be fun to use on something. Some more gorgeous lace. Wow. Yeah, you kind of spoiled me, Rose, I think. <laughs> a nice little vintage... piece of linen. This would be fun to almost make into a bag or something. 
That's beautiful. Very fun. And some gorgeous, gorgeous beads. I like that they're matte, like painted matte, and they're just a very, very pale pink. Wow, I'm, <laughs> I'm kind of, in sh you know, in awe of everything that that Rose sent. Oh, and then here's some pretty blue stuff. I wonder if she kind of matched them to the cups. I know she said that she put the items for the cups separate. So some beautiful blue ribbon. I just noticed my battery lights going on, so hopefully I'll be able to get through this before the battery goes. Wow. Beautiful, look at that. That's gorgeous. Some other beautiful flowers. Some pretty bling. Well, these are really pretty too. Look at those. Some more flowers. Wow, you have a lot of fun stuff from your stash. Another gorgeous little applique with some dangles on it. Wow, this is beautiful. I know Rose told me she likes light blue and I don't have a lot of light blue in my stash. So when I was making her stuff, I was um, trying to put in a little bit of light blue, but I just didn't have a lot. So now she shared some of her stash with me. So I love this, this is pretty. Some other beautiful little lace. Very pretty. Oh, this is gorgeous also. Very fun. Thank you so much, Rose. And one last package to open up. I'm kind of at a loss here with what's on my desk. I have a lot of craft stuff I'm working on off to the side, so I don't have too much room to move stuff here. Ooh, very pretty, kind of some vintage looking stuff in this one. And again, some beautiful lace that she has wrapped. Yeah, you guys, she really outdid herself because we were just supposed to send, um, you know, goodies to, to fill the cup. And obviously these are more than what would have fit in the cup. So, <laughs> wow. That's beautiful washi tape. Very beautiful. Oh, pretty flowers. Oh, I love these flowers. These are really pretty. Thank you so much, Rose. Wow. These will be fun to use in a journal. I think that one says home on it. Yep, with a little fence and a house. And I'm not quite sure if that's like a flower or something on that one. A tree. So yeah, these will definitely be fun to use as little pockets or something. Some other gorgeous lace. Very pretty. Ooh, look at that pretty lace. Yeah, she certainly has lots of beautiful laces and trims in her stash. Oh, look at this. This is stunning. I love that. That's gorgeous. This is beautiful too. This one looks kind of vintage to me. 
so pretty. Oh, look at that one. Isn't that gorgeous? Wow. Very pretty. I love this too. Another little piece of linen that this looks like it's vintage also. That is just gorgeous. That would make a perfect like wrap around on a cover or something of a journal. Gorgeous, Rose. A great big thank you to Rose for all of the wonderful goodies and the beautiful decorated cups that she sent my way. Thank you so, so much for being such a wonderful swap partner. And thank you also to everyone for watching today. And until next time, have a wonderful day and happy crafting.